My name is Julia Madrid, J-U-L-I-A-M-A-D-R-I-D. Uh, how often should you get to it? Sorry. How often should you get tested for COVID? I feel like you should get tested for COVID at least once a week for your own safe of mind, just so you know that you don't have to worry about it. Uh, why do you think it's important to get tested for COVID-19? It's important to get tested just so you know that you're not unknowingly spreading COVID. Um, once you have the test results, you could always know in the back of your mind you're not spreading any farther than um, any farther than yourself or to your family. Um, have you gotten tested for COVID here or at the district? I've gotten tested here at school. I usually go twice a week myself personally, um, just so I could keep updated from the just the week at school and the weekend after. So I like to stay on top of it. Um, how was your experience getting tested? It's super easy here, uh, way better than the nose COVID test, I really don't like that one. But this one is super easy, it's fast, and um, they help you through the process really quick, so it's really nothing. It's really nice to have this one here. Um, what would you say to your friends or family members who are hesitant about getting tested? If they're hesitant about getting tested, I get it, just because um, a lot of them think the testing is only the, the nose tickling one, the brain tickler. Um, so it's a lot easier to get the testing for the saliva testing because it's not intrusive into your nose. So um, it's super quick. If they're worried about it, there's really nothing to be worried about. It's super fast and they help you and talk you through the entire way. So there's nothing to be worried about for that. So it's nice. Uh, thank you. Yeah, you're all good. <laughs> Rolling. Say your name and spell it. Hi, my name is Merrick Combs. M-E-R-R-I-C-K-C-O-M-B-S. Ah. Um, why do you think it's important to get the vaccine for COVID? I think it's important to get the vaccine because we need to protect each other and ourselves from this horrible virus. We, so many people died and I think it's our duty to do as much as we can to stay protected. Have you gotten vaccinated? I have, in fact, gotten vaccinated. Me and as much of my family that can, because it hasn't been approved for children under 11. It will be soon. Um, but, uh, but yeah, no, I have. Have you gotten both doses? I have gotten both doses. Are you going to get a booster? Um, I haven't heard much about the booster shot, honestly. Um, if it comes forward that the booster shot actually helps and that it, um, you know, it's important to get for the safety of everybody, then I probably will. But honestly, I don't know anything about it. So. What was your experience in getting the vaccine? Um, the, getting the vaccine was actually pretty simple. We just, uh, we scheduled online with Kaiser and they just told us to come in at like uh, a certain time. It was like one in the afternoon and then we waited in line a little bit, very short line. And then I got stabbed and then that was the vaccine, very fun. And then we came two weeks later and then did it again. But um, yeah. What would you say to friends or family members that are hesitant about getting the vaccine? I would say, Get the vaccine! Uh, it's difficult to, um, it's difficult to convince people to get the vaccine, especially in this polarized environment, where if someone hasn't gotten it already or isn't even thinking about it, there's not much that you can really say to convince them to get it. But for those that are uninformed completely, or you know, they live in a rural area, so they don't think that they need it, just say, you know, you should get it. It's not going to hurt you. So you might as well, really. Thank you. Cut it.